Good brings good. It may start small, but when nourished, it always grows. Hello. <laughs> this will be an inspiring story about two wonderful women that even as refugees in an unknown land and with an unknown future have managed to deeply touch the life of many. They managed to make the best out of an impossible situation. We are happy. <laughs> we are happy people <laughs> from Ukraine. My story will end with more than 150 refugees that went out to clean the streets of Berlin in order to say thank you. And it starts with a simple idea of one woman with a very big heart. This is Berlin Central Station, and this tent is the City Mission's Welcome Hall. If you came to Berlin from Ukraine, you have probably visited it. And this means that you have most likely watched this video guide. Привіт! Якщо ви вже перетнули кордон з Німеччиною і опинилися в Берліні, головне зробити глибокий видих. In the first stages of the war, a lot of refugees came to Berlin. At that stage, so many good ones all over the world have started to do everything they can in order to help. But there was still a lot of confusion and uncertainties. Anna, a good friend of mine, wanted to create a space where people could get reliable information that is simply presented in their own language. So we decided to build a video guide to Berlin. We just needed some people that know the language and that are willing to help. My husband um, um, wrote me and he told my, my uh, our two wives uh, are in Berlin and the daughters and um, maybe, maybe you can help them. Natalik and Olena fled their country with their daughters and left everything else behind. When I met them, they were tired and worried, but they still wanted to help. I wanted to ask why, why, why did they want to do it? First of all, because we really want to help. Yeah. Yeah. We want to be yeah. helpful for Ukrainians. We're just searching uh, the way how to help Ukrainians. And then good brought some more good. After finishing this project, together with Anna and a group of other talented women, they have created something remarkable. Yes, yes, it's all started for Ukraine, yes, because it was so important. It's, it's important that you have a place where like, you can feel your culture. The idea was simple. It starts with workshops. You sit close, work together, and slowly get to know one another. Afterwards, comes food and music. People like this place because we do something to the, together and uh, remember our culture. In the last few months, Café Ukraine was visited by hundreds of refugees. For them, it is a warm place where they can always find someone to talk to. It made such a difference that they all wanted to give something back, to say thank you. And when they met Anna from the litter picker, they had a great idea. On a sunny Sunday afternoon, they met in an unattended corner of Berlin, and together they gave it some love and attention. I want to say thank you for Berlin, <laughs> and I want to be in a clean Berlin. <laughs> Beer? Um, yeah. Sehr möchten. And this is it. You plant a small seed of goodness. You take care of it. And it grows and grows. And when it grows, it always touches people along the way. If you haven't seen it before, you can go check out how this story began. It will warm your heart. And until we meet again, look for the good ones.